Hi, my name is Joshua Torrance, and I'm the executive director here at the Webb Dean Stevens Museum, and welcome to today's History at Three. Today, we're really excited to be in the Isaac Stevens House, where our director of education, Cynthia Riccio, is going to tell us about the kitchen. Hi, we are here in the kitchen of the Isaac Stevens House and just a little bit of women's history for you. It was common that the women worked in the kitchen. Women tended to do most of the work inside of the house during colonial times. Men tended to do all the work outside of the house. So this kitchen really reflects what a middle class family would have had in their kitchen. One thing that is particularly fancy is this reflector oven. So if you've ever been to Stop and Shop where you see the chickens on the rotisserie, this reflective oven is exactly that for colonial times. And that's probably one of our most popular things to look at when we come into this kitchen. Well, thank you so much, Cindy. I don't know about all of you, but now I want some good rotisserie chicken myself. Uh, thank you so much for joining us on today's History at Three. We look forward to seeing you tomorrow. Of course, we look forward to seeing you back on campus when this whole crazy pandemic thing is behind us. In the meantime, please stay healthy and stay safe. Uh, we were really looking forward to seeing you back on campus as soon as we possibly can.